Virgo, welcome back to Distilled Tarot. My name's Shannon. I'll be guiding you through today's reading. This is going to be our daily reading for Wednesday, March 31st. Let's see what's going on with Virgo. At the heart of your reading, we have the Fool. Wanting to take a risk, put yourself out there, try something new, have a new adventure. The challenge is the magician in reverse. Someone's manipulating the situation. You have someone working against you, hoping that you'll fail. Um, Six of Wands reversed at the bottom of the deck tells me that you have some detractor. This might just be energetically, like, I think they're telling you to the, to your face. Like, yeah, that's a great idea. You should totally do that. But inside and behind your back, they're like, I don't know why that they think they can do that. They're totally gonna fail. And by connecting your energy with this person, like sharing what you're doing, sharing your hopes for the situation, they see your excitement and they're just raining on that parade. And I don't think you see it. Your focus, Knight of Swords, Page of Pentacles reversed, Queen of Cups reversed. So you're moving quickly towards something Definitely looking out for yourself, prioritizing your own emotional needs here with the Queen of Cups reversed. But this Page of Pentacles reversed tells me that um, you might be uh, unwilling to learn anything new here. I'm just getting the energy of like uh, stubborn, not listening to new information. Let's see what else comes out. Show me the recent past. Three of Pentacles reversed. You, you've had to rely on someone in order to get a project off the ground or it, it's something that, like, you've been required to rely on them. But here's that sneaky energy, like, they were working against you the whole time. You might actually know this, and that's the fool energy. Your reaction to this knowledge is, I want to go off on my own somewhere. I don't want to have to rely on this person anymore. Because the Three of Pentacles is like belonging to a group and needing to work within that group. The Fool is very independent energy, wanting to break free from that sort of thing. What's the energy of the environment? How is Spirit supporting Virgo and nudging them in the right direction? Hanged Man in Reverse. Uh, getting out of the situation. Oh, I see the Page of Pentacles. Um... You've learned all you needed to learn. You've absorbed all of the value that you could get by working within this group, and now you're ready to go off on your own. That makes sense now. Show me the near future. Four of Pentacles. It's an interesting leveling up from the three progression, a failing group or a group that was letting you down, going off on your own. Well, is the, are they going off on their own by this point, Four of Pentacles? Or are they settling? 
Is this settling energy? Yeah, you guys, I think it is a little bit of settling energy, like, um... Like, I can make this work a little while longer. Let me just hold on. I can make it through. Surprise energy is the King of Cups. Now we have a pair on the board, the Queen and the King of Cups. This is a, someone who wants to support you, an ally. How is the ally going to support Virgo? How are they going to surprise them with support? Oh, you're going to feel super discouraged and they're going to be there for you. Um, so you're going to be feeling the Queen of Wands reversed energy like just... Uh, let me think of a good way to say this. D deflated. Whoever this King of Cups represents to you, they're going to show you a good time. They're going to cheer you up. They're going to get your mind off of whatever has caused your deflation. They're going to remind you who the heck you are. You're the Queen of Wands, damn it. Powerful, attractive, brave, bold, desirable, charismatic. You've got it going on. Don't let the don't let the haters get you down. Don't let the other people who aren't high achievers drag you down. Show me hopes and fears. Ace of Pentacles reversed. This is interesting. Who just had this? Another sign had the Fool and the Ace of Pentacles, I think in the same positions. So you might have um, another placement. I think it was Cancer. You might have another major placement in Cancer or be dealing with a Cancer if I'm remembering that reading correctly. Um, you're afraid of missing out on an opportunity and it's surrounding this whatever you want to go for with this fool energy. You don't want to let any manipulation hold you back, anyone who doesn't believe in you. I'm glad you have that King of Cups in your corner. With someone like that supporting you, it's like you can make it through almost anything out there in the world. The end result, we have the Hermit reversed, which is really echoing the Hanged Man reverse, the way that Spirit's trying to influence your situation. There's a lot of pinging going on, like ag agreement with all of these energies. Um, so the hanged man isn't only connecting with the page of pentacles in that you've looked at a situation up, up close and you've learned everything that you could learn about out of the situation. You've gained all the value and it's time to get unstuck and move on. But the, the hermit in reverse is like, you've also been cooped up, isolated, um, stagnant. And the way that you're going to end up is by 
reconnecting in some way. Reconnecting with society, reconnecting with friends, reconnecting with life. And then the Hermit is also talking to the Fool here, because the Fool wants to go on an adventure, and the Hermit is like, yeah, I've been cooped up for so long, I have cabin fever, I really just need to break free and get out of here. Show me advice for Virgo. Yeah. Um, you've had enough R&R, it's time for some adventure. Four of Swords reversed is like, you've had the rest, you've had the relaxation. You're kind of maxed out on peaceful serenity to the point of, if I don't have some adventure in my life, I'm gonna scream. So find a way to inject some adventure in your life. If that's what you're craving, whatever this full energy represents to you, if you can't go on the whole adventure, like find a way to, to get a bite-sized piece of that in your life. Um, it's gonna do your soul a lot of good. Virgo, I hope that helped. Enjoy the rest of your day, and I'll see you back tomorrow. Bye.